Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports news briefing for Monday the 15th of July. The local media headlines today. Now if you've ever driven through or across many of the world's tunnels or bridges you'll know that you don't always have to stop at toll booths. Modern technology, well actually these days not that modern, has made it much quicker and easier and results in less air pollution. How long do you think it will be before Cornwall and Plymouth have caught up? The short answer is that we're still talking about many, many years, but at least on Friday a bunch of councillors will start talking about it. The technology's not cheap, but there are long-term savings. The King's speech this week is expected to signal the kick-starting of a major house-building programme. I wonder if this will help the major house-building programmes we've already got in Cornwall. There's a full meeting of Cornwall Council tomorrow, but one thing they won't be talking about is the privatisation of Newquay Airport. It's still happening, it's just far too secret for ordinary councillors to know about. Today was supposed to be the day the new ferry service started to the Isles of Scilly. It's now advertised for Saturday, but don't hold your breath. And there's a whole range of new jobs looking to be filled working for Cornwall's new Labour MPs, the first full-time professional positions of their kind in Cornwall for nearly 20 years. The BBC caught up with that news that Cornwall Council is asking the government to appoint a minister for Cornwall as part of its pitch for more devolution. We should find out later this week exactly what County Hall has in mind just as soon as we've forgotten what happened to its previous devolution proposals. Greatest Hits Radio promotes a new exhibition at Truro Museum. The Falmouth Packet covered a nasty accident on the M5 near Exeter on Friday which caused long delays. The Cornish Times has a story about a man who needed somewhere for his Lego collection and finally Cornwall Live has a list of pizza places. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye-bye.